Hi, Timothy Unkert here. In this video, I want to talk about Emacs CUA mode. But first, let's talk about how we copy, cut, and paste in Emacs. So I'm going to highlight a region here. And I can copy this with Alt-W. And then I can paste it with Control-Y. Now, if I want to highlight the region again, I can cut it with Control-W. And I can paste it again with Control-Y. So that's the Emacs way of doing things, but it's a little bit different than what some people are used to today, which is control C to copy, control X to cut, and control V to paste. But what if there were a way in Emacs where you could set it up so you use control C, control X, and control V? Well, it turns out there is, and it's called CUA mode. And it's very easy to set up. So you have Emacs set up in CUA mode for every time that you turn on Emacs. Okay, so to set it up, you want to have the menu bar showing. Now, typically I don't show it, but to toggle the menu bar, I'm just going to do Alt X and then type in toggle, a space, and then menu, and I'll just set a tab, and it gives me toggle, toggle menu bar mode from frame. I'll hit enter, and the menu bar will show up here. I'm going to click options, and then I'm going to go down and click on use CUA, CUA keys. I'm going to hit uh, I'm going to click on that. And now to save it for future sessions, I'll go down here and just click on Save Options. And you'll see down in the mini buffer that the file init.el in the directory .emacs.d was written. Okay, So it went ahead and saved that as an option. I'm going to now toggle the menu bar mode from frame, just so I have it the way I like it. And I can highlight this one, and instead of doing Alt-W to copy, I can do Control-C. Okay, I can go down here and now paste, instead of Control-Y, Control-V. Okay, and to cut, I can do Control-X, and let's say I wanted to do something silly, like put a paragraph in the head of an HTML document. Never do that, but uh, I can do Control-V to paste. Okay, so uh, it's very easy to set up CUA mode. And I hope you found this video informative and helpful. If you did, could you please give it a like as it will help get out to more people? And could you also consider subscribing if you haven't done so already? It really helps the channel grow. I want to thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.